Can you hear that? That is the sound of hypocrisy. A couple weeks into this convoy protest and the political elite have lost their minds over the economy. It's a strange turn of events after spending nearly two years doing everything in their power to destroy it. Well, we had to. It was a virus. It was the only way to uh, save the country. Nowhere have I seen in any pandemic planning was the destruction of businesses, alienation of Canadians, locking kids up for two years, and destroying people's hopes and dreams, an important measure in fighting a respiratory virus. So I just find it funny that all of a sudden, when things aren't going the way that the political elites would like them to go, they have a giant hissy fit. It's unacceptable that we've gone nearly two years. We're still in largely the same place that we were. You know, forever ending lockdown still looming over our head, backed up with the threat of digital IDs. We need to keep pushing until every one of these individuals who has force this on us and specifically our kids is held accountable. Never forget that.